לחזון השלום שלי, חיים בארץ הקטנה שלנו, שני עמים חופשיים זה בצד זה, בשכנות טובה ובכבוד הדדי, לכל אחד הדגל שלו, ההמנון שלו והשלטון שלו. We also recognize that the Palestinians also live there, and they want a home of their own. We want to live side by side with them. Two free peoples living in peace, living in prosperity, living in dignity. I outlined a vision of peace of two states for two peoples. I removed hundreds of roadblocks and checkpoints to ease freedom of movement in the Palestinian areas. I took the unprecedented step of freezing new buildings in the settlements for 10 months. No prime minister did that before, ever. In such a genuine peace, Israel is prepared to make painful compromises. I said in my life for four years that the solution is a state of Palestine. We are prepared to recognize the state of your state. It is a big deal. It is a big deal. תופסת, היא תופסת שטחים, שטחי מולדת שלנו, זה לא דבר של מה בכך. And Israel continues to seek an historic compromise with our Palestinian neighbors. Six Israeli prime ministers, myself included, have not succeeded in achieving peace with the Palestinians. My predecessors were prepared to make painful concessions. So am I. Because I remain committed to a vision of two states for two peoples. We want a peace that would end the conflict once and for all. My position has not changed. I don't support a one-state solution. I don't believe that's a solution at all. I support the vision of two states for two peoples. But I want you to know, I have not given up on peace. I remain committed to a vision of peace based on two states for two peoples. A community of nations that is very concerned about the two-state solution in general and the settlements in particular. What is your vision for that state? Well, I laid out my vision for two states, for two peoples. I haven't uh, changed. It's there.